Hello ev there, everybody, and today I will be illustrating dad jokes because they're great sorts of humor. And I have this dad joke generator. And yeah, the first one that I got is why is a hot why is it always hot in the corner of a room? Because it's always ninety degrees. And I have a small confession. I read it wrong and read it as uh, why are hot dogs always in the corner of a room? And yeah, that was kind of stupid of me. But it still works because what I'm saying is that the hot dog is very hot and it's in the corner of the room and it's hot in the corner of the room, which is why the hot dog is over there. And it still works and you can't sue me for it or anything like that. And yeah, I think this joke is funny and I did it. And that's my little confession on how I totally messed up this drawing. And literally no one cares. But other than that, yeah. Uh, my second confession today is that I filmed all this over a week and a half ago, I think, by now. And just never published it. Or, like, I just didn't want to film the audio for this. Because filming audio is kind of... I don't know. I'm just lazy. I, I don't have an excuse. I'm just lazy. And so yeah, that is my second confession of the video, and I will have one more. I think one more. I don't remember if I have a fourth, but I know I have at least one more confession in this video, which you guys will see later. Uh, but yeah, other than that, just, you know, coloring in a hot dog, shading it, whatever, putting it in the corner of the room. And that this here's when I realized that the hot dog wasn't the part of the thing, was actually, it was just hot in the corner of the room. Like, I knew, I got the 90s degree part about it, but I didn't realize, it, whatever. So, here's where I just kind of added a thermometer in. And yeah, the second joke of this video that I'm going to illustrate is a burger walks into a bar. The bartender says, sorry, we don't serve food here. And I have actually seen this joke before, and I still think it's funny, because I just have a really bad sense of humor. But I thought it was funny, so I did it. Obviously, you're watching me draw it right now and put sesame seeds on a burger. Actually, sorry, no, I'm not putting sesame seeds on a burger right now. I am putting legs on a burger. Nope, I'm drawing the counter now. That's what I'm doing. And now I'm drawing the person. And yeah, I don't really know what to say here. I'm sorry. I'm just, you know, doing line art for a burger walking to a bar. The bar says we don't serve food here, whatever. I drew a girl in a suit because I love, I don't know, I think that's cool. Yeah. And, yeah. Okay, unpopular opinion, I love drawing hands. I I don't need to, defi to defend myself, I just think they're fun to draw, okay? And you can sue me for that one. Uh, yeah. You cannot sue me for the hot dog in the room, but you can sue me for enjoying to draw hands. I don't know, they're just fun to me. I, I think they have cool shapes. It depends on the position the hand's in, but usually I do enjoy drawing hands, and it's just a weird quirk about me and drawing. And one of my favorite things to draw is swoopy hair. Like, I don't like drawing straight hair, uh, but I do like drawing curly or wavy hair. That's just fun. And the finding things that I always do with my characters are like the noses, eyebrows, eyes, shapes, and then the hair. And then also the colors and everything like that. And any like details like birthmarks or whatever. I don't know why I'm saying all this. I just don't know what else to talk about. So I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, the way I color is... I have everything in layers, and then I do that thing where I draw in, like, them in order, so that after that, everything goes behind everything else. You know what I mean? You're watching me do it, so if you don't understand what I'm saying, you can figure it out from there. But I'm just going to assume that you do figure it out. And, yeah. I went with a really bright overhead light, but I never drew the lighting because I just didn't feel like drawing the lights. I don't know. I'm not trying to make masterpieces. 
Um, and then I go with like an overlay layer and everything, and I change the background colors and all that stuff. And yeah, from about here, I have a burger walks into a bar. The bartender says we don't switch it here. And here's my third confession, because I got a, a backwards poet writes in verse, and I thought that joke was funny, but I didn't know what to draw for it, so I did it again. <laughs> And that's my third confession. I didn't do the first one I got. And what I went when I said was, uh, fruit flies like an arrow. No, time flies like an arrow. Fruit flies like bananas. Yeah, some it's something like that. Whatever. And so yeah, I drew a bunch of fox with wings, circling an arrow, and flies like house flies or whatever that I didn't really try on, circling a banana. They're not really circling it, but that's beside the point. And I used like a painterly, felty brush to color everything in. I like the way I made the banana look. I mean, it doesn't look like an appetizing banana, but it looks like a well-drawn banana. And you know what? That's all that really matters to me. And I don't know, I like this brush. I don't use it that often though, because, yeah, I just don't use it very often. But yeah, and that is my third and final bad joke of the day. And yeah, that's all the art I made in this video. I hope you enjoyed. I will be going to summer camp now for a week, so any but anything you comment or whatever, I won't see for a week, but I'll see them when I get back. So please comment, like, subscribe, etc. Anyway, thank you. Tell me my voice is annoying and my art is terrible, or tell me my art is decent and my voice isn't that annoying. I don't care. Have a great day. Bye.